Hey, it's Allie B from Allie B Coaching, and I'm so glad that you're back here. And my name is Allie B Covington, which is ABC. So you're gonna quickly see that everything that I teach and is just my way is ABCs. It's easy that way. It's simple, and and there's so much. So I like to keep that simple for you. And so today, to get you started, before we do anything, it's just so important to know the truth. Of our life in this moment and i'm wondering if you are currently on that hamster wheel we've talked about this before and so uh you're you're on that hamster wheel and it's just like you're putting one foot in front of the other every day showing up and it's like a, it gets to be like a rut right and i want you to take a deep breath because today we're going to start with just the truth of our life and your life and awareness and the A is for awareness. Have awareness is the first thing, right? So going back to those beliefs that you just think about your beliefs about what you think. Some things you believe just globally, this is how the world is. And some things are your personal beliefs. This is how I am. I'm not good enough. I'm not, I'm not fast enough, smart enough, whatever, right? How many, and you have to tell yourself, it's like, those are old, unserving beliefs. Again, the ones that are serving you, keep them. But if something's not serving you, go start here. We just be living here when we don't even know why. So now today we're starting here. And, you know, we, we have these ideas and these beliefs and these feelings. And we don't stop and, and say, hmm, what, what does this mean? What is this happening? And how do I feel about this? So today... I just want to make you aware that the first step in our lives in order to move forward and have these breakthroughs and have amazing things happen and look at and feel great is we have to have awareness of where we are, okay? And as I talked about and I'm presenting to you is, is there's six pieces of wellness and they're the actual pieces and it's so cool and I didn't make this up. It's like Many, 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 many years ago, I can't think of the, the guy's name off the top of my head. And this is what happens with my brain. There's so much in it. I have so much to share with you, and this is real. But there's six pieces of wellness, and I, I kind of put it all together the way that it works for me. And the six pieces are: P is physical, intellectual, emotional, connectional, which is social, environmental, and spiritual. So I want to make you aware today of those six pieces of wellness, and I'd like you to. Spend some time getting the truth about your life on where are you on these six pieces. And okay, there is no judgment allowed. We're going to just kick that out. So no judgment allowed for, for, for this or anything that we're doing. So I want you to get so excited about it and go, wow, this is so cool that I have these six pieces that I'm trying to balance in my life. Okay, and remember, there's no judgment allowed. It's just where are you at? And where would you like to go? And we're going to talk about closing the gap. So it's like, where are you at? And where would you like to go? And get so excited about where you want to go. And then we're going to make that happen to maximize your strength in all areas of these wellness. And then you can live with outrageous joy. And it's really cool. And assess your awareness of your six pieces of wellness to get started. I'm so excited for you. And then we're going to do an exercise. So I have got tons of exercises for you. And some days we're going to be doing full workouts. And some days I'm just going to share an exercise. Just so that's like sometimes baby steps of like, you can do this, right? Because some of you exercise every day and you've got a lot of strength in the physical components, you know? And some of you haven't been moving very much. And so sometimes it's important just to like do what you can. And Okay, so this first exercise that I'm going to share with you today, of course, it starts with an A and it's called in a run basque. It's one of my favorite, favorite exercises. And I'm inspired by my love of running and an arabesque, which is a ballet move, which I am no ballerina, as anybody can tell you. Um, and this is just a really great move for strength, for mobility, for stability, for balance. It's going to tone your tush and it's going to give you just strength and power. And it's just a really good overall exercise. So this is how you're doing the run desk. You're going to make sure that you are standing up nice and straight and tall when you start. Your shoulders are down and back. You're squeezing those shoulder blades together. Your belly button is to your spine as you're coming down to the ground, okay? And as you're going down, you guys, let your ankle feel unstable, okay? That's going to strengthen your ankle. It's going to give you better proprioception and balance. And you're going to strengthen the other leg. You're going to kick your leg out all the way back. And let that leg that's on the ground, it's going to get stronger. 
and let it let it feel unstable if you get off balance just pick yourself back up this is life right in the struggle is where we get the strength so let that ankle feel really unstable and that's where the magic happens right when we're uncomfortable when we're unsure when we're uncertain that's where the magic happens physically and in all our other parts of life okay so as you're seeing me doing this in run best just kind of keep that mindful is keep those shoulders down and back squeezed back really go slow be in control and as you bring that leg back squeezing that glute and then you're going to stand back up and as you come back up you're going to balance and then you're going to drive your leg up knee up toe up into the run part and you're going to put tools in your toolbox so as i'm giving you these mindset tips as i'm giving you these exercises just think that i've given you this toolbox and you're going to put your tools in the toolbox and it's just going to be amazing and i'd love to know what you thought of the exercise how you're mastering it and of course um any comments and leave leave comments leave suggestions what would you like to know what questions do you have how can i help you how can i serve you i'm here for you i'm here to help you look good and feel great so that you can live your lives with outrageous joy actively bravely and creatively okay and of course don't forget to subscribe so that you cannot miss a thing not miss a tool there's going to be so much so many tools uh, mindset and movement Okay, have a great day.